Hey guys, welcome to the Beardful Gaming on YouTube. We are playing through Yoku's Island Express. I think this is episode three, if I recall correctly. Uh, an excellent, excellent indie. 3D platformer, right? Maybe it's indie, kind of indie. I don't know. Regardless, great game. Highly recommend it. And let's jump in where we left off. Dance a little. Music in this game is pretty good. Like, it's not the best music I've ever heard by any means, but it's very good. Very, very good. Very, very good. Right. I did not refresh myself. Oh, yeah, we just changed our ball color. So we have a lot of stuff to do. We've got to deliver some packages. We've got to do everything everywhere. we got to get that purple freaking flower power is what we need. Dear goodness. Yeah, so we did all of this. I think we got everything up here, probably. Not up here, though. There's so much more that we haven't even explored yet. I mean, look, there's like an entire northern area. Like, there is just so much still yet to do. There's so much. We need to, like, go diving over here still. Gotta go back here to get the uh, mailboxes. Like, there's just so much that we still have yet to do. Alright, so for right now, we just need to pick a destination and start moving towards it. So, what is down here? Umbaza's puzzle. Okay, so we need to get the puzzle pieces there and there. So, the main story missions are gonna take us up, and then right here, we still gotta go to the boiling underbelly. Alrighty. I think we need purple flowers around here. Yeah, purple flowers there. Yeah, so which way do we need to go here is what I'm trying to kind of figure out here. Not to mention we still need to get 300 fruit for this little guy over here. Oh my gosh, I keep hitting the wrong button. For that guy. Um, hmm. I guess... Okay, how are we supposed to get that? Oh, that's flowers as well, okay. Um... We already did all of this. We need a purple flower to get to that wickerling. I'm not sure what those red flowers right there indicate. Um... Yeah, so that's the queen bee. So actually, we could probably... Well, it's, it's kind of far away. Let's check something here. Let's see where these three packages go and see which one's going to be easiest for us to get right now. Let's be productive. So let's see where Sin is. So Sin is... Oh, that's literally the one that we were doing... Oh, we still need to do the Toolbox or Sandra as well. There's so much we still need to do. Hey, Raven! Welcome to the stream. Yeah, so let's go ahead and go back. We should be able to get over to his place super fast and deliver this package really quick to start the day. How's it going, Rave? Welcome. Thanks for being here, as always, my friend. Good to see you. What the heck? All right. Boom. Shortcuts. Loading? What's up with loading screens? I've never seen this before. What is up with this game loading? That is so bizarre. It's never done that before. Weird. Yeah. Druid horribly abandoned you. He's just a terrible person like that. button. Thankfully, I didn't ruin everything like I thought I did for a second. Oh, 
All right, let's deliver this package. Don't want to be disturbed. Oh, okay, so now this is how we deliver the package, is to go around his house. It's kind of weird, but whatever works. Can we even do this again? I honestly do not remember exactly how we got up on top of his house. Do we have enough wicker links for this really quick? I'm a little close. Um, maybe it's like right over there? Is this it? No. How did we get up there? You even started watching his previous broadcast of Fire Emblem? Yeah, he's a pretty big Fire Emblem fan, actually. He's done quite a bit of stuff in it. Played uh, most of the games, to my knowledge. Maybe I do have to be up there. I can't remember it now. Oh, maybe it was just right here. Yeah, this is it. Okay. That's funny. So I had to deliver a cake to him. But he didn't want me in his house, so I had to, like, jump into his roof to deliver it. That's funny. Right, really quick, though. All right, there we go. Let's go see if there's something else over here. Or if he says something different now. Nom, nom, nom. Who's out there? Go away. I'm uh, working. <laughs> okay, cool. All right, well, we got one of the packages delivered, so that's actually a decent little start for us today. Oh, that's actually... What the heck? Well, I didn't expect that to happen, but I guess we're back at the start, so we might as well do the stuff down here now. <laughs> this game seems cool, except for the pinball. The pinball is what makes it awesome, man. Like, like it's just so... It's so freaking creative, man. Like, this game just seamlessly transitions from, like, a platformer. There's secrets everywhere. Like, it's so good. Like, I'm not a fan of pinball at all, but this game is just, like, so good. Like, it's such a unique little setup. Like, I've never seen a game like that. Might be a secret over here somewhere. I think it's as far left as we can go, yeah. No, I actually highly recommend this game. Like, I, uh... I'm pretty big, pretty critical on a lot of games, but... Like, this game has been super, super enjoyable. Super enjoyable. While we're over here, there's also a mailbox that we need to attend to. Like, really, the only quote-unquote complaint that I think could be thrown at this game is that there's a lot of backtracking, but, like, it's not... Like, the backtracking is... What the heck? Just moved into this tree. The lazy slob we used to live here left a wickling behind. Oh, that's funny. The slug gardener has more than a professional affection for the slugs. That's weird. When the space monks moved to Ivory Peaks, one particularly nostalgic toad refused to leave their old church. I wonder if the toad is still there. Huh. That's actually really cool. Living in the Optanium Outlands. This is a bit species. Only allows the bees to get near. Skvader? A rainbow of fruits are shooting out of its ear. It's so cool. I didn't even know this was a thing. It's cool. It's creative, but you hate pinball. 
the hate of pinball started with Pokemon pinball. I actually love Pokemon pinball. Like I said, I am not a pinball fan, but Pokemon pinball and I guess this are the two exceptions. Pokemon pinball is also indestructible. I uh, had a copy of it that I lost outside for... Um, I can't remember exactly how long. I think it was like over a year or something like that. And uh, randomly one day, just walking outside like doing whatever I was doing in the gravels below just randomly what do you know Pokemon pinball been run over by vehicles crushed down into the gravels completely demolished in like every way but yet it was still there unharmed still works the battery cover was broken off of it. That was the only thing that was damaged with it. Just the battery cover. Because that was a Game Boy game that you had to put a battery in for the rumble features. So it had a battery. It's funny. Funnily enough. Which I admit the battery part is kind of weird, but... Tater was also playing this game and really enjoying it. My gosh. Yeah, but with that said, even if you hate pinball, if you like platformers, you'll like this game. If you don't like platformers, this probably wouldn't appeal to you. But if you like platformers, then this game, I think, would still appeal to you. Alright, we're back up here now. Cool. Okay, so we pretty much got everything done over here now, I believe. So we actually won't have to come back here later, which is kind of good. This right here is why I wouldn't touch it. Fair enough, fair enough. Alright, um... Need the flowers there. Yeah, I guess... Let's go ahead and deliver the toolbox. We can do that along this little path here, so. Kind of be productive on our pathing. This is also a Metroidvania. So if you like Metroidvanias, this is honestly more of a Metroidvania than it is a platformer, truthfully. It has platforming elements, but. I guess it's a platforming Metroidvania, honestly. Would be a fair way to put it. My toolbox, excellent. Stand back and I'll get the bridge repairs done. We can't show you this, it's too graphic. You try. Ivory Peaks, nothing but snow and space monks up there. Cool. I'm, I'm a big fan of this game. I think one of the biggest factors that makes me love it is the, just the secret hunting is just so satisfying. What is this? Horrible death. It's like a cutscene? Dipper loaf. <laughs> or maybe please don't be afraid I am not the one responsible for this I am Dipperloaf guardian of those too small to protect themselves the tragedy struck fast an evil creature was upon us before I could do anything then only dark when I awoke, I was maimed terribly and wearing the brand of the God Slayer. Worst of all, ones. I sit here now and weep forever for my lost friends, my broken trunk rotting with sorrow. That's actually really sad. This game is actually pretty morbid at times. No 
not even the sun finds me anymore. This grove is cursed by the evil force. Only sorrow remains. You would have been welcome here, Beetle. I get so sad. Ivory Peaks. Hmm. Boom, baby. Oh, was I supposed to, like, beat this thing? Did I, like, mess this up somehow? Oh, I can fix it here, okay. Oh, what am I doing with this ball? I have no clue. It's something. Okay, where is this leading? Okay. This is kind of weird. Life finds a way. Oh, I rescued one of his eggs. What is this? An intact egg? Knowing that at least one of my little ones got away is like sun on my heart would. You have my ancient gratitude for returning it. I will use all of my remaining energy to nurture this into a life. It must be a sign. Hope for this accursed grove. That's pretty cool, actually. I have no idea that was what was going to happen there. Alright, but now we have to go back down here again. I'm supposed to get over there. I can't tell. Am I supposed to go up there? That doesn't seem right. I mean, I guess it has to be, though, because I can't... I have to push it down. So, yeah, I guess that's just an area I don't go to yet for some reason. Weirdly enough. So, the question is, do we want to keep going this way? Like... I guess we will. Let's we'll keep going. Boom, baby. And back we go. Thing. Go over here again. Bounce suck. Get bounced. And roll. And get the wickerling. Boom, baby. So that gives me nine. Like, just the little quote unquote puzzles like that are just so much fun in this game. Aerial Ascent. Let's go this way first. Wait, wait. Ivory Peaks Trail and Tunguska's Lighthouse and Sutling Sanctuary. Okay. Hey, mail. Warning. Obtainium shoot ahead.
What's going on down there? Why is no one answering my calls? The settlings must be slacking again. The floating obtainium is spilling out into the air. I don't know who's down there, but you're gonna have to get both hatches shut pronto. Everyone will get their ha their hams warm if we miss another shipment, so hurry up. Hmm, okay. Let's go ahead and get this wickerling down here while we're thinking about it. Curious what happens if I just stand here. Does this like hurt me or do I get shot up? So wait, what? I don't even know what just happened. Can't go that way yet, obviously. So I guess we'll go the only way we can. Another wickerling. Sweet. Hello, rabbit. I used to live down on Makamana Beach, but I just couldn't stand the neighbors. Especially that big eel. I can never prove it, but I'm sure that its lair is filled with all sorts of stolen goods. Okay, guess that's all he has to say. this? Oh, well, I'm, I, I, oh no, what have I, yep, I ruined everything. It's kind of depressing, gotta go all the way back now. I don't get why there's like two little flower checkpoints literally back to back, that's kind of strange to me. Oh, it hatched, what? The egg has hatched, and from it emerged Chomp. The birth of the tiny critter has set me abloom once more. Please, Beetle, accept this as a token of my gratitude. Oh my gosh, so much fruit! Oh, and a bowl color. With red paint, it looks morbid. Appropriate. Chomp is proof that when we leave this place, life is brought in anew, such as the eternal cycle. That's pretty cool. Hey, Druid! Want me to post it? Want me to post in the Discord for you? What are you talking about, Druid? Glad you're here, by the way, buddy. you would enjoy this game, Druid. It's a Metroidvania, which I know you love. It has platforming elements, puzzle solving. Like, I think you would like this game a lot, Druid. Alright, let's go pick up whatever it was we missed over here. You got the Skyvader. Skvader. This rainbow creature lays eggs that appear in bubbles, bringing good fortune to those who pop them. Okay. I'm still not sure what you were asking. Post what in Discord? What are you talking about, Druid? Hey, look, it has a little butthole. Lays eggs that appear in bubbles, bringing good fortune to those who pop them. I don't understand what that means, but okay. I didn't? Pretty sure I did. Fairly certain I did. Yeah, I did. 11.45 p.m. Time for more pinball platforming and then Jackbox. <laughs> you, you apparently can't read today. You also didn't read... You also didn't read when I posted um, earlier. I said, tonight's Jackbox... Hope to see you guys there. And then like two minutes later you comment, Are you doing Jackbox tonight, Bearded? It was just humorous to me.
yesterday at 11.45 and you got confused? True, true. It was. It was technically yesterday. That's weird. So much going on right now. Me to go. Wait, what? What? This is like awkwardly confusing. There we go. So this is gonna close that thing. Ah, okay. Cool. I can reopen it. That's bizarre. Really wanted to see the Lion King, so you went out and saw that? Awesome. I've heard mixed things, but mostly... I've heard it probably about 25-75, with 75 people saying they liked it, and 25 saying that it was an embarrassment to the Lion King name. How'd you feel about it, Druid? Why did that just do that? I could have went back too. It's good, not as good as the original, obviously, but better. Fair enough. I heard that there was something they took out that people were mad about. They took out like uh, took out like one of the scenes where it talked about like Simba learning a lesson or something. I was reading, I can't remember exactly, but it was like they said one of the most important fundamental parts of the movie was like left out or whatever. Not sure which way I should go here. Looks like up may be a secret. Well, that's just back. I can't go up. Okay, so we gotta go this way. luck thing. What? It's ham. What? It's like ham. What is going on here? Why is there ham? There's so much ham and bananas. I don't even know what's happening right now. <laughs> Everything's going crazy. Didn't expect there to be infinite ham. It's mostly frame frame perfect. I noticed a few additions, but not really any omissions. It was something, um, the, I can't remember exactly. The lesson that Simba learns about, um, what was it? It was like the one where the monkey, like, has him outside and he's telling them something. I, I can't remember, like I said, but that was the one that people said was omitted. What is that thing? I, I don't know what just happened. Gotta figure out how to get that chest. Looks like we're gonna have to fall down on it. Okay, so I should be able to go up now, right? 
Take me with you! Talk to this guy again? Both hatches are closed again. Go ahead and send some obtainium up. Stand back or you'll be knocked right up along with them. Okay. That wants to be knocked up. There we go. Was unexpected. <laughs> this this is the guy named Chirp. Hey, thanks for the help, Beetle. This place is just a mess since our foreman Jomja left on a spiritual journey. With the Obtainium coming through, we'll be able to make the Space Monk's deadline after all. Here's something for your trouble. Well, I guess let's try this. Hey, I did it. I did it. That is what four? Yeah, four of eight. I mean, I was reading it online. I, I can't remember. Like I said, I can't remember what it was exactly. It may have just been somebody complaining to complain. It may not even have been true. I don't know. Just a thing I saw. Minerals is hard work. If you spill something, it's lost forever. It's true. To so the Space Monk Monastery. Yep, let's destroy boxes. Try Googling, Druid. Try Googling. Um, New Lion King leaves out important scene or something like that. Every Peaks Trail. Delivery. There's a something habitat in the cave ahead. Something's in that. They are quite feral. I don't let anyone but Tunguska, the lighthouse keeper, get near. Tunguska may look frail, but back in the day, that old rat climbed to the top of the ivory peaks. He's only a something and a piece of string. So it looks like I have to have the flower ability in here to do anything. Unfortunately. Hey, Cal Rune is here. How's it going, buddy? As always, it is a pleasure to see you, Cal Rune. Karun, one of the true regulars. Hmm, come back to that one. Hey, so, 
a, a wicker link. It was 99 degrees here? Oh, dang, man. That's awful. I am truly sorry to hear that, my friend. Alright, without the pink flower power, I don't think we're going to be doing anything up here. Yeah, we gotta have pink flowers to do anything up here. Oh well. I guess we came up here for basically nothing. Very well. Back down we go. <laughs> I think I forgot to get that treasure chest over here anyway, right? Or did we already get it? Wait, now I'm confused. Where's the treasure chest we missed over here? Didn't we just miss the treasure chest? I'm really confused right now. Yeah, there it is. Okay. How am I supposed to get over there? I don't get it. Huh. It's just going to take me in that little hole. Oh, wait, I haven't unlocked this cannon trail yet. That's what it is. This cannon trail will take me there later, it looks like. I think. Yeah, because I don't have that cannon trail unlocked. That's 100% what it is. I don't have the B line unlocked for that. That's, yeah, I think that's what it is. Okay. Regardless, here we go! We actually didn't go this way yet, did we? I forgot about that. Regret. I'm gonna keep working my way up to attack my fire emblem. The lighthouse. Okay. Who knows, maybe we'll get the flower power right here. Those wicked siblings have gone into hiding. They work hard in the mines and drag on all sorts of filth. It's time for their bath, but they saw it coming and hid from me. Won't you help me find my sootlings? There are six sootlings hiding upstairs. I'll keep the top warm while you look for them. <laughs> Help me out now, I have a nice reward for you. Please hurry. Hey, Beetle, are you here for the pilgrimage? We're just about to set out. We're gonna climb the Ivory Peaks and visit the Space Monk Temple. Oh, I'm Tylo. The overdressed one is Jam Jam, who's a bit overly concerned about the cold up there. The big quiet one is Om. Don't worry though, Om is very friendly. Anyways, we'll be off in a bit. Join in if you want to. We'll be on the Pilgrim's Path marked by the Red Ribbons. We haven't gotten any extra gear, but if you talk to Tunguska, the lighthouse keeper, I'm sure something could be arranged for you. Climbing gear. You help me with my circling problem and we'll talk about it. Please hurry and find them all. You got it, Sketch. You know me well. You know me well. Hmm. Alright, let's clean some sootlings. Aha! 
Aha. Hey, it's a fishy friend. That was just so satisfying, man. Yeah, I got you, Raven. I know I stream late. I know I stream late, but it just is what it is. What that was actually changing. Hey, we got it. We got some ham. All the ham and bananas. Infinite bananas. Ham and bananas. Ham and bananas. Home and bonobos. You guys know that song? Opals and bonobos. Opals and bonobos. Please tell me you guys know that song. You know the song? Good. At least I'm not alone in that sketch. Slugs. Oh, I see. Kevin, you know the song too? But you don't know the song, Raven? How do you not know the song? It's the it's the the apples and bananas song. It's like the song of childhood. Like you said you just basically say the same thing over and over, apples and bananas, but you change the vowel, so it's Eeples and Beninis. Eeples and Beninis. Opals and bonobos, apples and bananas, etc., etc. Why can't I hit this thing? Hey, there we go. That was how I was supposed to do it the whole time. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Hey. I actually did something relevant. There we go. Oh, I missed the thing. Missed it again. There isn't like a true death. There is a death counter of sorts. Like it's like every 10 deaths you get, it takes you to like this secret room where you see like this jar of evil filling up or something. So I think there's something to do with it. But you don't really traditionally die. There's no way to fall off cliffs that kill you or anything like that. It's just... Hey, you got it. Just like when you hit these thorns, you die. That's like the, really the only way to quote unquote die. But it doesn't like reset you or anything. You just keep playing. So close. There we go. Hello, frog. 
What would you say? <clears throat> well, since we yet to watch the skies, we'll be launching our spaceship soon. No. The low wind force and blue skies indicate perfect launch conditions. Just hope they manage to sort out the engine trouble before the launch window closes. Hmm. Oh, a chest. Look at you hiding. It. So there's one down there, and there's one over here. So I'm gonna have to come back up, regardless which way I go. Pinball nostalgia. I mean, this game is great. I recommend it. Like, I truly, truly, truly recommend this game. Like, like, extremely, extremely heavily. This way, right? Oh, I actually need to go backwards here for a second. I forgot about that. Nope. No! Up oh, death. Did I really just kill myself an additional time accidentally like that? That's frustrating. I cannot hit this thing. There we go. Oh my gosh. Really? I did it and then I didn't do it. Go! There we go. Here we go. Let's go this way. Got it. Now I need to go backwards. Depressed now. Both cover and I misspelled machine, but in different ways. That's funny. You burned all the pinball machines? I think you just had a negative experience with a pinball machine, and you're letting it haunt you to this day. Aha! There was a wicked one in there. I thought there might be something like that. Sweet. Barely missing it, man. Oh my gosh. Not what I meant to do. Oh my gosh, I still didn't get it. Still didn't get it. Alright, on the tip. Boom! Not what I meant to do at all. Alright, on the tip. I'm doing it wrong, slightly. What am I doing wrong? Maybe it's like not on the tip? No, it's definitely on the tip. That was it, I felt. Why can I just like randomly not do this again? Oh my gosh. negative enough to hate all pinball machines. Fair enough. Fair enough. We all have things we hate. Just like I hate ranch dressing. I think it's the worst thing in existence. Wait, there's a chest down there too? I do need to keep going this way. Darn it. I'm going to have to come up here a third time. Oh, I, oh, okay, cool. That's actually pretty handy. Okay. Now let's go this way. All the way down this time to the chest. Sootling Leash. This old leash identifies you as a friend of the Sootlings. Huh. Find your own Sootling. What? Oh, and it's a shortcut too. Perfect. Huh. 
That's really interesting, actually. So, I think I got everything here now. Oh, they're all cute. Look at this. <coughs> Fluffy. I can't even remember what voice I was using now. Fluffy and adorable sootlings. How could I ever stay mad at them? I can tell that you respect the sootlings. So as thanks for your help, I want to have my old sootling leash. Take it with you to the sootling habitat in Frost Pine Forest. With the leash in hand, the sootlings will guide you on your journey up the Ivory Peaks. At least there wouldn't have been. But you've already helped yourself to it, have you? Or at least there would have been, but you've already helped yourself to it. Because you consider that your reward. That's cool. So I actually did it like out of order accidentally. From the top floor balcony, I hope the launch will be a success. Cool. Ah, screw it. While we're here, let's open this thing. We can't do anything with it, but... It's random that we can get our own sibling now, though. So, I, is there any point going all the way back up here? I don't have the flowers yet, so... I don't know what to do. It's like, do I want to go all the way back over here? I think not. But what if it gives me the flower power? <laughs> I don't know what to do. Alright, let's get our own sibling. Wait, there's a thing here? There's so much I've missed! Tells me nothing. How did I miss this telescope before as well? I want to know. Did I not go this way? I'm just so confused. See, there's a shortcut right here if I have the flower power. I don't feel like we get the flower power here, but maybe we do, maybe we don't. I don't know. We'll keep going, I guess, just in case. I feel like this is going to be a waste of time in the long run. And I guess this is kind of a shortcut, though. a good question, Raven. What is everybody else up to tonight? I bet Calroon's doing wow. I bet Sketch is fixing breakfast. I bet uh, Druid is reading the Bible. Those are my predictions. Let's see how close I am. Um, yeah, let's go down here first. Spot on for me that you were doing D&D earlier. Awesome. You've got a sibling on a leash. Hold left trigger or right trigger while flying near carnivorous plants to grapple. Release to let go. We now have the purple flower ability. Yes! Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. have the freaking purple flower ability. Even though it's kind of awkward. Oh, that was it. I'm so happy we have the purple flower ability now, guys. You just don't even know. Definitely takes some getting used to, though. Gosh, come on.
Hmm. Yeah, that's gonna take some getting used to. For sure. That is so cool to have the freaking flower ability now. I'm so happy about it, man. You just don't understand. There's been so many times in this game where I'm like, man, I really wish I had that purple flower ability. It's finally coming true. Heather's there up ahead. First stop is going to base camp. It's going to get rough from here on. <laughs> Reach your base camp. Nice to see you decided to join us, Yoko. This is the first time I've seen someone climbing with a sutling. Uh, I guess Tungusuka really did hook you up. <laughs> well, we're just gonna hoist up some more supplies, but we'll be right along. We've gotta push for base camp as soon as possible, so go on ahead. Now, before I do that, what is right here? Good news, by the way, guys. I m will hopefully be featured in a YouTube video soon. I'm not sure how big of a role I will be in it. Like, not me as a person, but, like, my channel and stuff. Um, so I'm kind of excited for that. If that comes to fruition, I will definitely... Share it on everything, of course. Yeah. See, here's the, here's the death thing you were asking about, Calvin. When you die a certain number of times, this happens. Like, I've died 50 times now. Oh. That doesn't normally happen. That does not normally happen. So there is something that happens. So now there's 50. I, like, unleashed a beast or something. So close to that, but not quite there. Hey, here's the the meat. It's so random. Wait a second. I thought I could just push myself up there for a second. How's it going, Swifty? Thanks for the host, as always, my friend. It's been a couple days. How's it going? What was the point of that? I guess that was just it. 
Alright, let's keep going. There's something below me here. See, there's something below me. That's bizarre. Like, what is that there for? Maybe right here takes me to it? <coughs> there. Hmm. Wait a second. We can actually do a thing. Yes. Shortcut unlocked. Everything is good in the world. Recently had a puffy eye? Well, that's awkward. Like pink eye or like allergies or like what was the what was the cause? Reminds you of a cartoon character? I mean, that's a good thing, right? Actually, yeah, I think it's a pretty sweet emote. I'm very happy with it. Hey, bug. I swapped this map for a spinous private stash. Made it all the way up here before I realized I don't even know how to read it. Supposedly, it's just the location of every chest on Mokumana Island. So you say, I'll put with the treasure map for 300 fruit. Absolutely. Enjoy the treasure hunting, bug. Shows all unopened treasure chests on the map. Yes, that is awesome. I can't go up that way. Might have been an eyelash or some dust. Oh, okay, fair enough. Well, thankfully it was nothing serious that you recovered from it. That's what's important. <sighs> it's pretty cool to have the chest mark now. I like that a lot. I have enough fruit for that, wow. Wait. Alright. Let's keep on trucking. Wait. Maybe this way. And there's a telescope. Ah, okay. Let me look ahead. His name is Sticky Beard, the cartoon character? Uh, you should be a regular. Let me make sure you're a regular. You actually were not, but now you are. So now you should be able to post links, I believe. Oh, I actually need to go down here anyway. Eh. Yeah, I guess I'll do it now. See if I can get enough momentum to go off this edge. Oh, really? I can't do it? Oh, oh, that was almost it. That was almost it. Sticky beard. I mean, that's probably appropriate for my beard when I had it that long. Yes, I did it! I did the thing! No! Ooh, I got it. Saved everything. How did I miss this before is the real question. I uh, did not mean to do this. Didn't really matter, thankfully. That's wrong button, whatever. Sticky Beard the Pirate. Oh, well, I'm trying to do it fast. It just doesn't happen. <laughs> so I don't know how to get to below me there. Yes, we had to go up, right, okay. Name sounds familiar? It does to me too, actually. Can't place it, though. What? 
confused on what the purpose of that hole closing was. Oh, was that like blocking me? I think I see what happened now. I just kind of accidentally dodged the troll. Boom, baby. Oh, look at the pineapples. Nice. Loving this freaking climbing gear. Now let's keep going up for a second. Uh, well, apparently you're stuck here. There we go. Oh, it's blocked? Huh. There's another one below me. It's like all kinds of little wickerlings, like right here. No, that wasn't right. That was not right. No, that wasn't either, actually. That little wickerling seems kind of tricky to get to, actually. This is going to take a couple tries. Got it. Oh, I didn't get... What? That had to be it, I thought. Wow. I can't believe I didn't get that. I don't know how else I'd even do it. Actually, wait. No, I'm not far enough right. Hmm. I legitimately don't know how to go to that one. I don't think I can make it go in that, that direction either, huh? I don't know if I'm overcomplicating this or if it is actually this hard. Hmm. Maybe something like that just on the other direction. That might work. Don't know for sure, but that's going to be the thing we try. So let's go this way. We're just going to slam into the wall. No, that doesn't work. But what happens if I just... No, that doesn't work. That doesn't work. Hmm. So close. don't know how to get this thing. Like, you guys have any ideas? Like, what am I doing wrong? See, the wickerling's right below me, that there. It's not... I don't know if I can reach it that way. But there's no other way that I could possibly get to it other than that. I just got it. Okay. That works. That was just extremely tight, I guess. All right, which way do I go here? Let's go this way first. Is 
can like cool off the lava. Is that gonna kill me? Yes. Hmm. Interesting, okay. What did I think of these similarities? I mean, let me take a look here really quick. Sorry if the everything lags for a moment. Candy Pirate Captain. That actually does work. Yeah, that's similar. That's from uh, Kids Next Door. Yeah, I remember that. I actually remember that now. I did not remember it until then, but now it now it comes back to me. I can definitely see where you get that similarities for sure. figure out what this one's about. Like, is there another way? There's not another way in here. Like, how in the world am I supposed to do this? Without candy, pretty much. Wait, where did this come from? Wait, what? How did I miss this before? Or did I just forget about it? I think I just forgot about it. I can do anything right here right now. Wait, maybe I can. No? Wait. I got an idea. What about this? Let it go. No, it doesn't let me grab it on the way back. Hmm. You've been gifted to a lot of streams for subs? What do you mean by that? I can't possibly. Like, it has to be something with this thing here, which I can't do yet, I guess. It's very weird. It has to be something there, though. Yeah, no worry. No way else it makes sense. Let's check one more thing here, just in case. Right, yeah, I know you mentioned that before that you had quite a few. People either like you or you're really lucky, one or the other. Can't go that way. Hmm. There doesn't seem to be anything there. You've got new ones? That's awesome, man. How many do you have in total? <laughs> that cat wonder, is that a dog or a cat? I can't tell. It's like an awkward up close animal photo. All right. Seems like we've done everything we can do in there for now. So onward we go. There, you made it. Guess you're more sturdy stuff than what we had you figured for. Mm. We've got a problem now. The space monks have been getting awfully protective of their work lately. They don't like people stopping by, so they've closed off the path to the big monastery. But I've already got a plan for it. Mm -hmm. If we all pitch in have our own path to the big monastery in no time. Oh, you will find one of the dry seed pods we saw below. Oh, if you grab a bucket and fill it with some fresh spring water from the hot springs over to the right. 
Tilo, you have to find me some guano. Oh, wait, let's move on, everyone. We've got a lot of work to do. Get fresh water from the source. Okay. You have an empty bucket. Alright, let's go this way first. That was an easy wiggling to get. How many do we have now, actually? Uh, 13. Nice. I'm not sure, but these are all your gift sub emotes. Very nice. So it looks like at least, what, like 20? Oh, here we go. I don't have enough, though, darn it. I need more fruit. Yep, guess we'll come back to that. Ah, that opens that. Okay. So now I have to backtrack a little bit. Okay, interesting. It's a good thing we did come this way first, then. Did these guys have anything else to say? I don't think I double talked to them. Why did I get the dung duty? I'm overseeing the work just as important as the other tasks. Oh, of course. 14 people with their own emotes, some people I'm some too have some pending. Awesome. Yeah, I just got my third one as you can as you know. Just got my third. Assistant, good to see you. I'm looking at the next chunk. It sits right above us. But it seems to be stuck in the ice. Don't fret though. I'm not going to try climbing again. <laughs> I've got another solution for this. You just worry about uh, knocking it loose. Well, go on then. I believe in you. Go get it. <laughs> Not even the nibble. This place is called Crater Lake. Believe it or not, there's a whole lot of water just beneath the ice here. The legend has it that this is the spot Mokuma landed when Mokuma arrived on the island, leaving this big crater behind. I don't know if it's true or not. I don't care much about myths or legends. Hmm. Rinse and repeat. Level 32 for words and string? That's crazy, man. Like, I mean, if you had a group big enough. If you had a group big enough, though, it could happen. Or, I guess, enough enough just really intelligent people that know their words. I'm afraid I don't do tricks involving water, so you got to dive in and get the chunk. Instead to be part of the trunk missing, please see if you can find the rest. Alright, let's go diving. cool actually Woe is me. the chunk is broken into so many pieces we need an accomplished craftsman to fix this oh the foreman at the obtainium mines owes me a favor take the pieces over there and have it fixed up in the meantime i'll get to work on finding the next chunk see you back at my house wink wink you can see what you you can see what you put until halfway through the timer. Right, that's we got that far. Where you can't see other people's answers. That's where we lost. Hmm. 
That's pretty cool. Like that little side quest. What is this? When the horn of the mountain sounds, the ancient one weeps. Bad. We need seven freaking fruits. Are we really gonna have to backtrack for fruit? This is upsetting. Just need some fruit. I've actually never ran into this situation before. Like super low on fruit. What are you doing? Came here to get some guano, but this stuff just ain't fresh enough. Hmm. I'll figure it out though. Just need a couple minutes. Won't tell you how many you have to get. That's possible. Yeah, that would be another way to make it harder. Oh, maybe she'll help me down here. I like it. Okay, okay, we get it. Guano is bat poop, that is correct. You got a dry seed pod filled to the brim with fresh seeds. Ooh. <laughs> it just vanishes. Let's see if this guy's ready to do anything now. You learned that from Ben 10? Guana? I was never a big fan of Ben 10. <laughs> actually a problem. I, like, I don't know how I'm going to get more fruit. Need freaking like seven fruit. Guess we got to go this way for now. That way, yeah, okay. So you go up there, okay. Not a big deal. Thankfully. Thankfully. You found an interesting fact that on Fibbage a couple days ago. Did you know herrings communicate with flashlights? Um, I did not know that. Definitely did not know that. Yes! Never wanted ham more than right now. What's going on? Am I like dying like 10 times over? Oh my gosh. What am I doing right now? I'm so excited for the ham. I like lost my brain. Yeah. 
Just can't do it. There we go, I got it. Okay, there's my bananas. Nice. Just get all the freaking fruits that I can right now. back, random fish. I'm honestly just trying to get some extra fruit. And I'm just literally missing everything. More ham! Life is complete. We got more ham. Ah, uh, wasn't ready, darn it. Reminds you of the art style of Rayman. Yeah, I can see some similarities with that for sure. Well, didn't mean to do that. Kind of want to go over there. I don't think I can, though. Like, it looks like there could be like a little entrance or something secret there, kind of. Love when the fish just doesn't save you like it's supposed to. That is so hard to get in there. If so, I don't, I don't really think you can. But we're gonna try it. Oh, there was. Look at that. I knew there was a secret over here. I knew it. Like it just was too obvious to not be. A hard bed of near frozen mulch. Well, we can't even do anything here. <sighs> That's depressing. Can't even do anything. went ham when he saw ham, pretty much. Alright, let's scare this bat. Hey, look, it pooped. Look at all the bat poop, all the guano. Poop bat, poop! Everywhere! Just defecate. Just the diarrhea piles up. Just so much of the poop. So much bat poop. Just look at that, just pouring out. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, Bat, you're gonna be empty. You're gonna feel so cleaned out. Come on, Bat, give me everything you got. Empty those bowels. Clean out those intestines. All right, there we go. I think we got enough Bat poop. I was really hoping that something would happen if you did it enough, but I guess not. That smells a lot worse than I imagined. Oh, you just scooped it up like that, huh? I mean, I am a dung beetle. Seems you've got the guano situation under control, so I'll just uh, head back to camp. See you there. Oh, bat poop. The bat is stinking rich. Might have to ban you for that one. Might have to ban you for that one. Ooh. Thanks for helping me out with that guano. I guess him like it just came more naturally for someone like you. A dung beetle, I mean. <laughs> Not sh throwing shade on being a postmaster. I do know about dung. Everyone's got their own job. You go get that water. Right, right, right. Yeah, okay, I know. I know. At least we have freaking stuff. I 
Oh, wow, there actually wasn't anything over there. Except this, I guess. I haven't used this telescope, of course. Okay, so there's something above me. The horn and the water. So the, probably when I blow the horn, the water erupts, I will say. I could just totally throw myself off this if I wanted to. Boom, baby. Your last punch stunk in this one, too. I have no words. Give me water! That's kind of disturbing. I really just want to toss myself off this cliff, man. Like, so bad. If I had a shortcut back up, I would. But let's not do it right now. Another time. Admitting they stink, that's fair. I mean, those, those aren't the dirtiest jokes, at least. Goku, go ahead and put the stuff in the earth. What? Plant the beanstalk. Oh, okay. Seed. Poop. Water. Oh, my gosh. And thus, life is, is complete. Can't believe that worked. Can't believe that worked. Let's get climbing. Ooh. We did it. Let's get to climbing. Boom, baby. Hey, we can do this while we're up here. You're not as bad as true Lisa. Five of eight. We're making some pretty good progress on these things. Alright, let's use all of our fruits. wrong with this guy? Thank you so much. I've been frozen for days. I you you to meditate with hopes of becoming enlightened. I thought maybe the space monks would take me if I was smarter. But all I ever managed to achieve was knowledge of trivial things. For instance, I know you've collected 33 or 7 fruits. That's a waste of time. I'm going back down to my village. Come by and see me if you ever need my powers. Well, that was it apparently. Wait. Can't do anything there yet, so I don't need to fall down. Well, I guess that was pretty much the entire purpose of going that way. Down we go. Yep, not what I meant to do. We'll probably finish up this and uh, head over to Jackbox. Well, did not mean to do that. 
in about 20 minutes or so. FYI, everybody. Jackbox and 20. Heads up, Jackbox and 20. It's like an entire area there. No! Oh, yes! Climb to the highest peak. How did you beat me up here? We made it to the top! I don't know what I was expecting, but now that I'm here, it's just not what I was looking for. Monks are real. The inside of their craft. All right, here we go. This must be Boone. Hey, what are you doing down here? Stop that! Don't touch anything. My pilgrimage completed. I shall remain here and gaze at the beautiful vistas before us. There is music for those who listen. As I choose not to speak until my journey had been completed. Sweet. All right. Oops. I about did the wrong thing. Now there's the guy we're looking for. When you're breaking solids, you can't be afraid of breaking a few eggs. <laughs> Long ago, when the order resided in Marrow Hill, I had a mate who couldn't see that. When we moved to Ivory Peaks, I was forced to leave my mate behind. But it was all in the name of science, so it's okay. Wait, how do I get to that guy? Alright, let's talk to this guy. Welcome to our compound. I am Boone, leader of the Space Monks, and this is my spaceship. A letter for me? Hmm, my name says they're in dire need. Cannot be helped. We've got a tight launch window and we won't get another for years. Hmm, the ship engine does keep failing and there's something blocking the exhaust in the tunnels below. I go down to the engine room and I talk to my engineer to see what the problem is. I'll consider heading down with you after we've launched. Not leaving until we've launched the ship. You been below yet? I was trying to figure out how in the world I would get up on top of that thing here. see any way that I can get up on top. I'm a little confused by that. Bone sent you. Blocking the exhaust. I'm giving it all I got, but nothing's coming out. I'm gonna need you to head into that tunnel, or into the tunnels below, and so unplug it from down there. 
It's through the gate over by the cliff's edge. Fix the spaceship exhaust. Well, it looks like maybe a boss battle, actually. All right. Well, hmm, got about 10 minutes left. I don't know if I want to start a boss fight, though. Yeah, I guess we'll go ahead and go in. May not even be a boss fight. Wait, what? Found a little secret. How am I supposed to get that little fruit up there? It's like it taunts me. I got it, nice. Exhaust. Oh my gosh, what's nothing in here? It's kind of suspicious. All right, let's do it. Well, that is definitely a boss. That is definitely a boss. Alright, I guess we're closing out the day with the boss battle, guys and girls. Attention. Another banana, nice. Wait, that wasn't ready. I could totally just like do this. Oh no! I don't want to do that yet. Let's go this way. Oh my gosh. More bananas. Apparently just every time I just do it infinitely to get so many bananas. I'm not even trying to do it right now though, I'm actually trying to go this way.
Boom. Darn it. So bad. What? I actually legit, th legit thought I hit it that time. I just want to hit that thing so bad. I'm just like going brain dead on it though. Right, this is it. This is my chance. Alright, here we go. Let's go. Boom! I did it finally. One time out of like the 16 times I need to do it though. Can I just like cheese this entirely? No, I can't. Okay. Alright, back down we go. Two. There we go. I only had to do it twice. Thank goodness. All for 30 bananas. Alright, here we go. Space Monastery. Now it's a boss battle with a spider. I can't get in that little hole. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. It's like such a little precise spot there. Go through this cycle again. There we go. Crap, man. This is like kind of tedious. I'm 
attention in the slightest. This reminds me of the Donkey Kong 3 spider boss, kind of. Like, it doesn't work in the same way, but it just reminds me of it. Eric, I believe, was the name. Like, A-R-I-C for Arachne, basically. My gosh, why is it so hard to get up in that little gap? Slug. One part is just so freaking hard. Being in that little tiny gap. There we go. Let's not mess this up, please. So frustrating. This is not... I'm not liking this boss battle. This is the first, first battle, or really anything in the game, that I felt is actually more tedious than it is fun. I don't know if I'm just really bad at it, or if it's just this precise. Thank you. That's an appropriate use of fail. Hard. I had a slug, but I failed. There's this there we go. Got a slug out. My gosh. Okay, I got back up immediately that time at least. Slug. Oh my gosh, why did I not get that slug? I should have had that slug. Got it! Now, oh, come on, just do it. Actually, you know what? I need to do this before I forget. Uh, what just happened? Why did I get stuck there? That was bizarre. How's it going, Sherp? Sure. Kind of started the boss battle right before I was going to switch over to Jackbox. We got to kind of finish this. And it's, it's the most tedious thing in the game by far. Like, look at that. Like, what am I doing wrong? slug out. That's important. Now let's get the slug. Got the slug. Oh my gosh, why am I not getting the slug? Slug is out. The slug is out. Boom. Two slugs. Let's do it. Let's get the slug. Get the slug. Got the slug. Okay. Let's go back down intentionally. Fall back down. Fall back down. Fall back down. Boom. I need to hit that thing. Rock. I need to hit that rock before I time out. No, I didn't hit the rock. Why am I so bad? Got it, okay. 
Back down. Been watching since you got to the top of the mountain. Dear goodness, yeah, I've been here for a while. Like, look, I keep getting stuck here. That is really weird. There we go. Now let's go back down. And not get stuck, hopefully. See, I thought I didn't get stuck. Like, what was different? There we go. I knew there'd be a rickling in there. There's a because there's a wickerling, that's why. Little secret guy. Because there was a rock that you had to go backwards for, so I knew there was some type of secret there. I didn't know exactly it'd be a wickerling, but I assumed it would be something like that. Alright, there we go. I got the slug out. Now I need to go back up and do the thing. Let's do it. Boom, back up. Alright, let's get the slug. Ooh. Nope. Nope. Yes. Yes. There we go. Yes. It worked. It was sloppy, but it worked. Alright, we got a slug out. Got two slugs out. Let's go through its legs. Okay, we got that already. That's okay, I guess. Come on. Through its legs. Through its legs. There we go. One. I'm just gonna wait here, actually. Wait, what? I didn't even know I could fall this way. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Come on. <laughs> just gonna get infinite bananas here, randomly. There we go. Over this way. Through the legs, grab the. So, the slug grabbing mechanic in this game is like really, really finicky. So, the way it works is that you have to hold in one of the triggers whenever you pass a slug. But, you have to do it after the slow motion kicks in um, and not before. So, like, if you try to do it early, which is what I'm doing, doesn't work. So that's why I keep failing on the freaking slug sucking. Like, I just can't do it, man. Not to mention, this little spot here is like so precise for some reason, man. I don't get it. Seen that? Like it just I can't cannot get in that little hole each time. So close. So far. I honestly wonder if it might be easier to get in from the right panel or the right flipper. There we go. Back in finally. Okay. Let's go this way. Knock up. It's not what I'm gonna do. I got ham. Ham is good. Yeah, ham is unnecessary though. I have infinite stuff already. <sighs> Come on, man. Second too early. That's fine, actually. That's fine. Got the slug. Boom, baby! Fine! Spider baby. A lonely and abandoned spiderling. I saved it. I don't know if that mattered, but I saved it.
This little one has lost both home and family in the launch. Such a steep price. Do you know of any place that would take it in? Yes. Please bring it there. Soothe its weary soul. Okay, so now I have two spiders? Hmm. Confused, but okay. The launch was a success. I look forward my part of the bargain and head on down to the village. I'll meet you there, yokel. There's a beeline just below the peak if you can afford it. It's the quickest way to get back to the village. The space monks really don't let anything between them and their goals. I like the way they think. Now we do is need to find the last chief and then Nim can go ahead with the ceremony of healing. Let's go. Talk to these people really quick. Geometry went with the space monks. I thought it was all talk. That's funny. Okay, so. I like how my little fish guy is still down there. That's funny. So I need to use that thing here. I also need to still do this thing randomly. Um. Then I also need to want to do this. So yeah, let's go down here. Let's grab this. Then oh, we need to go back there too. See, so yeah, there's no reason to go back down. We still don't have this thing either. So there's a couple things we still need to do here. All right, we'll finish. We'll just get this, and then we'll call today. Because there's still quite a bit to do up here, actually, so. Yeah, that sounds fair. Alright, so let's just grab this and then this. That's what we'll do today. We'll call tonight. shortcut over here. Interesting. Alright, so we can actually fall almost straight down here. Down we go! Bounce. Bounce. And here we go. Now we have this one unlocked. Eh, yeah, really quick, we'll see where it takes us exactly. to do this then. How does this get to that chest? I honestly can't figure it out. Whatever. It is what it is. Not important. Checking my map, by the way, to see if I can fall on anything significant. I 
Uh, now I have two shortcuts. Beautiful. Beautiful! Alright, well, we know where that takes us. We know we still have stuff to do up here, so... Quickly we'll return, find a save flower, and call it a day for Yoku, and move over to Jack. of save flowers the game is saved and we've still got so much more to do so if you're watching on YouTube one of the few thank you for being there um, Yoku's awesome highly recommend it it's well worth whatever the asking price is I think this would probably be a game I would be happy to have spent 40 bucks on so um, we'll be back with episode 4 sometime soon let's and uh Thanks for watching on YouTube. Have a great day, guys.